hello everyone and welcome back to my youtube channel with another useful and informative video so guys in this video i'm going to show you how to fix imessage and facetime stuck on verifying phone number so guys if you are trying to activate your imessage and facetime but it is stuck on verifying phone number here i will show you how can you fix it so guys for that you have to simply watch this video till the end so guys first of all go back to your home screen now open settings on your device and then scroll it below and tap on general tap on about and check if there are any career updates available for you then you have to simply update your career settings and after this go back and tap on software update and update your software to the latest version so guys do this and after this scroll it below and tap on date and time and set your date and time from here or turn on the toggle for set automatically and after this uh, go back and now scroll it below and tap on language and region and tap on region and select your country or region correctly after this go back and tap on vpn and device management and make sure that there is no connected vpn on your device after this go back tap on transfer or reset iphone tap on reset and reset network settings of your device for one time as well so guys do this and check if the problem is fixed or not and if the problem is still there then you have to simply uh, go back to your settings again and now go to screen time and from here scroll it below and tap on content and privacy restrictions and turn off the toggle for content and privacy restrictions from here after this go back and now you have to open apps on your iphone and scroll it below and go to imessage or facetime here i am going to the messages now go to imessage from here and you have to simply turn off the toggle for imessage for 30 seconds and after this turn it on so guys do this and after this restart your device for one time and then check if the problem is fixed or not and if the problem is still there then you have to simply take out your sim card from your iphone for one time and after this restart your device again and insert your sim card again on your device so guys do this and check if the problem is fixed or not and if the problem is still there then you have to simply open the sport app on your iphone and from here you can get any kind of help from the apple sport team so guys you have to simply explain them your problem in a brief way and they will try to fix this problem for you within 24 hours so guys that's it for today's video hope this video helps you please like and subscribe to my youtube channel as well thank you